welcome back, everybody. Um, I'm on the Birdman Finch, and we're doing episode seven of GM Mode. Uh, this is Chris Dodd, not off camera. How are yeah. you? Yeah. Wonderful. And this, this is AJ, uh, hating me right now. Oh, oh, wow, man. It's been a week already. That's crazy. Man, it's yeah. blew by. Yeah. Um, let's get started. That's a good time. Um, John's not here this week. He's actually booking his brand first. And, um, yeah, um, it's going to be interesting because he, he, he's not been here to answer his emails and he could be here, you know, when we edit this and stuff. So that's what he, this could get into. So, so just a reminder, um, Chris played a power card on John, selected an opposing brand, reduced the length of one of their contracts by one week. So we'll have to see who that is. Um, so yeah, um, let's uh, see what happened. Um, it says Triple H, we just brought a new physical trainer. Ooh, okay. So who's going to answer this email since John's not here? Who wants to answer this? So I guess I'll answer. Uh, just yet. Uh, we brought a new physical trainer on staff. He's worked with a ton of sports brands, cutting edge stuff. We can loan him to your brand to help some of your superstars to help them recharge and recover most of their stamina. Uh, they would have to set out a show, though you can have them uh, long enough to train Carl Anderson and JBL for 30K. They'd be willing to bend the rules and let you um, let them lend them to you, train just one of those wrestlers for free. Your call. Um, well, JBL is his WWE champion, so I'm not going to have him train JBL. But call it, and I, oh, but call it, and JBL in a feud right now. Can I do that? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, but call it, oh, but the stamina is really low. Um, is that Z? Let's have him train Carl Anderson. <clears throat> Yeah, I just think it's like a few weeks off. We could just, I think John could be smart and just have JBL do promos or something. So, yeah. Sounds good. So I'll, I'll send him over. Um, I've had enough of this crap. Looking like SmackDown has been a complete joke. So, Chris, this is your doing. You're going to suffer the consequences because I think it's because of that power card you played. The only way you convince me to stay is with a 100K bonus. Otherwise, I'm ready to walk out right now. What's it going to be? So you can say, okay, right, I don't want to... I'm not going to... Or no chance. Right? It's a fucking jobber. All right, so... It's no a fucking case. job. 100K? <laughs> I think it's much. Goodbye. 100K! And you can keep he your money. He could literally go into free and get fucking someone for cheaper than that. Yeah. For more for more weeks. I think his, his budget went up. 795, $795,429. Um... Oh, this is weird. AJ, you can answer this one. Look, JBL has, okay. handed nothing, has handed me nothing but losses. Is there someone else on the roster you can match me up against for a change? You could tell him no chance, Carl, or sure, Carl, no problem. I mean, he's, like, he's going to be out. Sure, Carl, no problem. Yeah. He's going to be out. Oh, oh, right, right, right. Right, yeah, he's going to be out. Um, anyway, okay, answered. then uh, no chance. I already answered. Okay. Thanks, this is just what I need to get my head back in the game. Okay. Well, I mean, he didn't say it had to be right away. That's true. So, AJ, uh, you could do shakeups in the game. Uh, these add extra perks to your thin uh, that make, can make it easier for your show. Um, we'll pick. What we'll do is uh, I'll just do it random for John. Um, but here's what John can get. Specialists per training. All of your specialists, uh, superstars, get three plus mic skills. Um, second wind, all of your superstars gain five stamina, D deep discounts, all your t match types are free. So what I'll do is, um, I'll just do it random. Uh, what I'll do is I'll just, uh, go back and forth on my controller and whatever one that's picked is the one John would do. Uh, and one of you can just tell me when to okay. stop. Let me do it for a while though, cause I have to, it doesn't, like I have to go back and forth. So just tell me when to stop. Uh, my delay is the strongest, so I'll uh, I'll say stop. No, this since is John. This isn't I you. Won't even know where. This isn't you. This is John's. Okay. Just tell me when to stop. Am I saying stop? Anyone? Uh, stop. 
Oh, uh, he's got he's getting matched. All his matches are gonna be for you this week. So <clears throat> that's all the John stuff. Um, I'll go through this real quick. Um, he, for his commission to go, he can't put Becky Lynch in a match this week. So uh, yeah, and he gets injury rehab. So um, yeah, that's pretty much that's it. Good for him. We'll, be, we'll be right back. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome to. I don't even know what week it is because it's been so long since we recorded the intro to last episode. I'm in a completely different location. When did we do the last episode? I think, I think it's been two months since we did like that intro, I think. I think it was uh, PLE. <laughs> it's been a long, long we're, time. We're, we're, you guys had a PLE, and we're in week six, it looks like, if I'm reading this correctly. Well, yeah, so this is probably week seven then. Um, a lot of We've just been really busy these past couple of weeks. I don't have my typical blue snowball microphone this time around because, uh, you know, I'm quarantining um, for a couple weeks, um, so uh, I don't I couldn't go home and get it. Um, so uh, yeah, so pretty much uh, we have the original crew back. I figured, you know, poor quality or not, we should just do it because uh, we, we haven't done it in a while. So welcome this is back. The first John. time all four of us have been here since like week two. No, week three. I think oh, they be damned. It. Yeah. So, John, last time you were here, uh, lots changed in your life since the last time you were uh, doing GM. Uh, yeah, and you're just showing it off right yeah. now. So. That was a lot. Um, he got himself jewelry. Yeah. Um, Think of it. So you, John, are you ready to uh, – you're, you're up first. You haven't been on in a while. Um, we've had a PLE since then, so, uh, you know, we have to kind of work through um, – Kind of, uh, you know, what you've been missing. Um, I will tell you, I'll, I'll go over some things and I'll let you book your show. Um, why don't we just get started? Really terrible uh, segue, yeah. but I might be a little, I'm a little rusty because I haven't done a video, I think, since in like a few weeks. So um, let's just get started because that was bad. Um, so yeah, let's get started. Um, we're going to go through your journal. Um, remember there's a delay, so just tell me when you're ready for me to go through your journal. You ready? All right, I see it. So you promised, um, you would give Wayne Mysterio Jr. two weeks off. Uh, I think this is the last week you have to do that. I think, um, cause I'm pretty sure we did that last week cause we auto booked your show last week and I think they put him in a match, but we took him out because, uh, we want, we didn't want you to get screwed over in that way. Um, mm -hmm. this is in progress. You promised Carl Anderson that his next fight wouldn't be against JBL. Um, I'm pretty sure you can't book Carl Anderson this week because you got an email saying that he's in health training or something. Um, so you can't book Carl Anderson, I think, for at least this week. It was either him or JBL, and JBL is your champion, so we figured we would pick Carl Anderson. So just remember that. that Bradshaw won the belt back. Uh, I don't think he. I don't think he lost it. Actually, I think he's. I think he's had the belt a while. So, um, by hook or by crook. Yeah, ignition. Cabinet came out. <laughs> I like to think that. Um, ignition's contract expires in two weeks. Um, you also had a power card played on you. Um, I think AJ played this one on you. It's bad timing. So someone's contract uh, was um, shortened by one week. I don't know whose it was, but. Uh, that I think AJ played that power card on you. Um, also, I'll just go through this real quick. You got uh, there's these things in the game called shakeups. Uh, they kind of help to boost um, your chances in in the game and stuff like that. Um, you didn't really get a big one because we had to kind of do this ourselves last week. We kind of just did random. And this week, all your match types are free. So if you book like a Hell in a Cell match, that will be free. So you can book that this week. Um, it won't cost you any money. Right. Um, your commissioner goal is you can't put Becky Lynch in a match this week. Um, and if you don't do that, right. you'll get injury We have three, which means it reduces injury time for one superstar by three weeks. And I'm pretty sure that's going to be useful for you because, uh, I don't know if you remember this wrestler, but, uh, I think you have some, um, no, you don't have any injured wrestlers. So, oh no, you do. Yeah. Bray Wyatt. He's injured for, does that say eight weeks? Like, or does that say three weeks? I can't tell. Um, can't read. It's, but you could win back way because you don't have way wide apparently. So, um, yeah. Um, 
let's go over your season challenges. Just tell me when you're ready, and I'll go through it. All right. So you have to put 10 shows with all promo slots filled. Uh, so I'm, I don't know if you remember. I think that was the last time you were on. Make sure I definitely do that, because one week I didn't do that. Um, so um, you have to complete five trades. Uh, you couldn't do this one because this is ha this these happen after PLEs, and we didn't want to do any trades if you weren't here, so we were nice and protected your roster. You've already done this one to pass 600k in the bank. Um, you have to book three no holds barred matches, book ten tornado tag matches. You have to spend one million dollars or more on shows. I don't even think you can do that this week because mm -hmm. you only have seven hundred ninety-five thousand. I have seven hundred fifty. You have to complete 15 commissioner goals. You have to book 10 shows with all call-out promos. No, you have to book 10 shows with a call-out promo. Uh, you've completed this one. You've hired five wrestlers. I think um, we helped you do that one. And you have to book 10 TLC matches. So, um, oh boy. I'm pretty sure I sent this. That was, that was ruining the gimmick. Huh? That was ruining the gimmick. Yeah. Uh, you have to do it. Obviously, you can just do this throughout the weeks. So you don't have to do it all this week. Uh, just tell me what you want to do. You want to go to a book show. You want to go to logistics. You want to go to power cards. Just tell me what you want to do. Just book the show. Let's just right. get started. Hey. All right. So opener. What's what are my options here? Um. I believe Becky Lynch is in a feud with Tamina. Uh, you could do that. Okay. I'm not supposed to book. I can't book, book uh, Becky this week. Right. You can book at a promo because it says match, not a promo. Uh, it says don't put her in a match this yeah. week, but you can put, have her do a promo. Let's see. We'll do Tamina. We'll do Tamina uh, Mercedes, I guess. Okay. Uh, do you want to do a stipulation match? Because that is free this week. All right. Well, we'll do a yeah, no. TLC. It's TLC. Sure. Um. And you met you met your commissioner goal. Oh well, yeah. You okay? Because Becky's done the match, so you you as long as you put don't put Becky. Uh, you want to do promos? You want to do yeah. your mid card and main events? Uh, so let's put the matches first, then I'll see the promos. Uh, what else do you want to do? And you can't book Bray this week because he's injured. Or call Anderson because he's busy. This yeah. week. Uh, we'll do Ignition versus Rhea Ripley. Okay. Is that going to be a stipulation? Because that's great. Uh, no holes barred? Okay. That's Just not what I have to do. Right. Keep in mind, whoever loses will be injured for one week. Oh, uh, yeah. Nah, that's fine. Okay. And we, I, Rhea Ripley's probably... Oh, caution to the wind. Rhea Ripley's probably going to get injured this week because her stamina's at 32. So whoever... So if the condition loses, you could you could lose two wrestlers in one swoop right here. Do you want to take that risk or no? I'll uh, take the no holds barred off then. Okay. You can do... Uh, Tables. Um, I would recommend doing something where the stamina cost is low. I think uh, you have tables. Um, last man standing. Um, no, let's just do. Let's just do it normal. Just do okay. a normal match. Okay. Uh, what, what's it going to be a next mid card match? Uh, a lot of options. Um, uh, yeah, you have uh, Stone. Wait. You can do Stone Cold Steve Austin. You, you, the, the, and Matt Jackson. You have Ray Mysterio. Oh, you can't book Ray this week because uh, the tag champs. How did they become the tag champs? I think we made auto book and they. No, Steve did this. I think Steve did this because he booked a show one week and uh, yeah, he did this. <laughs> Who were the tag champs originally? I don't think you had tag champs, right? I think they were. I think it was Carl Anderson and Matt Jackson. I think. 
So did Mac Jackson pull a Cody Rhodes where he just won the tag team title off himself? I guess. Yeah. But yeah, uh, what else matches do you want to do? You can't book Becky in a match this week, so. Uh... You got it. JBL's got a 14 stamina. <laughs> Boy. Yeah. You might have to I'm sign really screwed here, aren't I? You might have to sign some people. Yep. Local jobbers coming on in here. <laughs> um, tell me when you're ready. I just went to your talent scouts. You can upgrade this if you want. Um, so that yeah, way you can get actual wrestlers. Okay. Uh, I guess we'll take uh, Adrian Williams, I guess. Okay. Do you want to just sign him for this week? You could sign him for one week. Yeah, just sign him for the week. Okay. I'll just sign him for a week. Do you want to, because you're going to, you're, a lot of the people have stamina. Do you want to use some scouts to see if you can get some actual talent? Sure. All right. You can do established stars, which cost you uh, one scout, renowned stars, icons, legends, immortals, and that's it. Let's do icons, I guess. Okay. Um, do you want to do a male, female? Or you do, are you kind of flexible of any gender? I'm flexible with whatever pops up. All right, you said whatever pops up, so I'm just gonna just gonna see what happens. All right, you got Undertaker, Roman Reigns, Charlotte Flair, and Sangha. You can see the class when it comes up. Oh boy! <laughs> yeah, a lot of money. Remember, you don't have to sign them. A lot all. of money. You, can, you, can, you don't have to sign them all for that amount of time, too. You can change the time, like you did for uh, well, who, who, uh, the other guy you just signed. EC, whatever the hell his name was, like yeah. cost me like nine thousand bucks. Oh boy! I recommend signing these now because you just use the scouts too. So it's kind of a waste of scouts if you don't sign somebody at least. Um, I guess I can do Roman. Uh, it's a tribal chief, Roman, Roman. I think, too. So, how long do I sign Roman for? Yeah. Uh, I'll sign for five weeks, I guess. All right. So you got the tribal chief. Said, right? Um, do you need more talent? I think you let me check. Maybe the best version of him. Call him for that for a long time. Yep. Um, uh, so. So I think we'll do a Matt Jackson versus the uh, the guy I signed. Okay. I mean, that's probably going to be other mid card match, I assume. Um, yep. And then there he's rolling in the main event. All right. What kind of match do you want this to be? Or do you want to just keep it a normal match? Let's, let's keep it a normal. All right. Keep it a normal. And then the main event. What's going to be the main event? Uh well, might as well use the new guy. Use Ro do Roman and Sean. Do you want this to be a? Do I, do I have this have a stipulation? Yeah, just... All right. Let's do promos. All right, promos. Okay. Oh yeah, I forgot. I forgot about the delay. Okay. Uh, so use JBL. What kind of promo do you want him to do? He can do self promo, call out, wall change, advertising, charity, class change, training. He, he tag team call out, and that's it. Maybe uh, maybe a self. All right. All right. So you got more. You got more people. Do Austin? What's he doing? Uh, call out, I guess. Get a call out. Because he gets call out. Call out. 
Uh, we'll do Roman and we'll set up a match next week. Yeah. And then one more promo. The only one you can really book is Becky, or you could just tell you could, or you can book Ray, but he'll be mad at you because you promised him two weeks off, and he'll be pissed if he does a promo this week. So she can't be in a match, but I can put her in a promo. Yeah, uh, I'll show you. Look at, um, yeah, see. It so says commissioner goal fulfilled. Um, you'll see it in a second. Okay. All right. We're good. Uh, what kind of promo do you want to have a do? Because I just kind of, is it self? Or do you want yeah, self's it? fine. Okay. Yeah, was, just do something. You want to go to your power card, see what you can buy or have in stock? Sure. Let's take a look. All right. Let's see what you got for power cards. Just tell me when you're ready and I'll read through them. Hey, I see it right here. All right. So we have um, Legend Whisperer, which means you can select a superstar on your roster to immediately increase their level to 20 and become legendary. Do you want to play that in anyone or do you want to save that one? I think we'll save that. You have injury we have. Oh, I have injury. Uh, oh, I should have looked at this first. Yeah. Um, you, you can oh. play this and have someone come back. Um, I think Gray would be the one that comes back. Yeah, I think we'll do that. So Gray is... He's back this week, actually, so you could, book, you could have booked him if you wanted to this week. Um, oh, well. You have bad advertising, which you can select an opposer brand who must use a tier one advertising logistic. I would recommend playing this one because I don't think we're very high on advertising logistics. So, yeah. um, two bit arena, select an opposer brand who must use a tier one arena. You want to play that on anybody? No. Bad timing. You can, no, select, an, you can select an opposer brand to reduce the length of the contracts by one week. You want to play that on anyone? I think I think I think I'm good with the okay. power cards. Uh, do you want to buy any or no? Nah. Oh yeah, you can play logistic. You money. can uh, either up. I think you can upgrade in the arena. Um, upgrade your backstage. Crew. No, I think. I think we'll wait. Okay, I like that. You're gonna wait. Uh, so let's confirm this. Let's make a little bit more money. Let me uh, go over the card this time before I just book your show. Um, the opener is the TLC match between Tamina and Mercedes Benet. Are you, are you cool with that? Yep. Uh, the self promo by JBL. Are you cool with that? And then we have uh, Ignition versus Rhea Ripley. Are you cool with that? We have Stone Cold Steve Austin calling out uh, Roman Reigns. Are you cool with that? And then we have uh, Matt Jackson versus, I forget his name, but uh, this guy. Do you want to do that or no? Yeah, yeah. Okay. And then we have Becky Lynch doing a self promo. Are you cool with that? And then we have uh, Roman Reigns versus Shawn Michaels. Are you cool with that? Okay. I'm going to confirm this booking. Ooh, AJ, you got... Oh, okay. All Let right. Save the best for middle, apparently. So apparently that power card didn't do anything last week. Apparently, um, I get 10% of your fans this week. Oh, great. I thought that was played last week, but I guess it's played this week. So uh, oh, so you didn't even... uh, you didn't, you didn't kick me down the fourth. I just did that all on my own. Yeah, um, I, I bet you. I bet you were kind of hoping that was the case because you were like kind of thinking to yourself, like, uh, "Oh damn, I was kind of yeah. hoping that." Now, now I don't have an excuse. Yeah, so um, we'll wait for Twitch to catch up. Um, oh, I did learn so. by the way. You can. Uh, you don't have to answer the emails in order. I learned that um, in South Carolina. You can. Uh, you can choose what order you want to answer the emails in. Um, I don't think. Oh, cool! Really I didn't know. That's new in the game this year, right? Because you used to not be able to do that. You used to have to answer them like in the order that they came up. Am I correct on that? Yeah. I don't, so I because think... I have no clue where uh, what emails I responded to last time, um, here's hoping I don't forget, you know, and piss someone off. Yeah. So let's see what happened. You have Joe yep. Willis sending you an email. Let's see what he wants. 
Let me know when you're ready and I'll read it off. Yeah, sure, whenever. Um, it says, Undertaker cheated me in that match. I want a rematch in the next two weeks. So you want a rematch with The Undertaker. You can say, All right, I can no, do that. You, you can say, I'll make it happen. I'll make it happen. All right. So you have Piper Niven. She's thanking you for the rematch against Ty Claus. Told you I get the win this this um th this time. Have to say you really look out for your talent here at NXT 2.0. So she's really happy with you this week. Nice, nice. Uh, I'm glad she says that because I'm pretty sure she's like on like zero stamina. So like I can't use her for a bit. It's not 23 actually, but still I wouldn't recommend you. Okay, it's not bad. Yeah, well, I mean, it's like below 30 is probably not a good uh, idea. Remember the shakeups because uh, you have an option to use the shakeups. So I'll, read, I'll, I'll wait for Twitch to catch up and then I'll read off every single one. You can pick which one you want to do. Um, okay, yeah, sure. Um, tell me when you're ready. You can start reading time. whenever. So we have safety violations, which means all match types cost 25% less, but superstars use more stamina. So that means they would cost you less, but uh, they, their stamina will go down more if you play those matches. Then we have Champions Resolve. Your male and female uh, world champions gain 15 popularity and are guaranteed to win all their matches with this shakeup is active. And I don't know if you can see that you have like, it will be active for five shows. So, um, so essentially the next five times we do this, you'll have these shakeups active. Then we have Hype Partners. Uh, superstars who perform a tag team callout gain an additional three stamina. So... Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, which one do you want to use? I mean, I know which one I would use, but this is your choice. I think I'm going to do Champions Resolve. You know, getting the popularity boost would be really good. And, um, you know, fucking Lorenzo keeps <laughs> messaging me every week because he gets his belt and then loses it again. I wonder how so, that's going to work, though. Like, having his belt for more than two seconds would, would probably be nice. No, but I wonder how that's going to work. Like, what if uh, your champion right now is... Uh, Gunther, I think. What if Gunther like loses the belt to like Lorenzo? Does his stamp does his popularity go up or does that like I'm not sure how that works. Yeah. Um, well, would it take effect right away or can I like hold on to it? No, it takes effect right away. So Okay. Well yeah, I, well, that's fine either way. Um but yeah, let's go through your journal. Just tell me when you're ready and I'll read through it. Okay, so I promised AJ Styles two weeks of rest. That's fine. Uh, at least one tag match this week. That's also fine. Um, you promised Joe Wheeler a rematch against Undertaker within the next two weeks. Promised Shannon Sachs Lorenzo a rematch against Gunther for the NXT title. I recommend doing that soon because we you've had that. He's he's at, he asked for that like a while ago. So yeah, contract uh, contract with Timbo expires at, at the end of week nine. Um, Triton expires at the end of week nine. Um, Dante Roberts expires at the end of week nine. Bray Wyatt expires. Yeah, I remember I, I signed a bunch of people last week because everyone's like pretty low on stamina. So, yeah, so yeah. I'm just reading these. Rhea Ripley's expires at the end of week nine. Undertaker expires at the end of week nine. And that's it. That's all the stuff there. Um, yeah. It's kind of funny. Uh, you and John have the same people, but they're different like characters, if that makes sense. So, yeah, like, yeah. Uh, but your commissioner goes, you have to have at least one. It's not tag match, it's tornado tag match this week, because there is a difference. And you get bad timing. I don't think I need to read this one again. This is the con this is the thing you played on John where he, like one of his contracts went down by one week. So mm -hmm. uh I'll read you through your season challenges again. Let me know when you're ready and I'll read through it. Sure, whenever. Uh book ten shows with an advertising promo. Book ten shows with a self promo. You have to spend two hundred fifty K or more on promos. You have to gain 225 popularity between all of your roster. Book 15 shows without an injury. I'm pretty sure you might... I'm not sure if you're going to be able to do that this week, but we'll see. Uh, you already did this yeah. one. You just passed 600K in the bank. I think you were the first one to do that. Uh, you have to book 10 shows with all promo slots filled. Book 10 shows with interference. Uh, you did this one already. Fulfill five promises to superstars. And you have to make three superstars very happy this... Uh, well, not this week, but at some point. Um... I will recommend, I should have told John this, I would recommend doing the season challenges, because uh, especially these next, like, before the next PLE, because I do remember, that's the whole reason Chris, Chris ended up beating me, because I was beat. he was, like, in last place when we did this, like, one day, and then 
he got a trophy and he was in first place. So yeah, that was a big thing we talked about was that uh yeah these trophies can really like make or break you. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so just t <clears throat> tell me what you want to do and then uh, we'll just get started. Yeah, well, uh, first of all, go to book show so I can, uh, you know, see my wrestlers. And you say you don't want to do your cards because John made the mistake. Oh, uh, yeah, right, right, right. Yeah, yeah, let's go to my cards real quick. But John made the mistake and, uh, you know, he and didn't because you could have played it on somebody. Yeah. Just tell me when you're I've been uh, I've been saving them most weeks, so I figure, you know, probably I should probably start actually spending some of them. Uh, so you have the Legend of a That's the card where... One one more of your boss will gain twenty popularity and they'll become legendary. Um, you have select you have homecoming, which means you can select a contracted superstar on your brand to become a permanent superstar for your brand. You have help spot three, which means you can send someone there, um, and they'll uh, be unavailable for this week's show and they'll gain ten more stamina. You have a superstar GM. You can raise the selected superstars morales, or you have help spell one, which is the same thing as three, except uh, they'll get six stamina instead of uh, eighteen. Do you want to play? Want to use any yeah. of these? I'm gonna use health spell one on AJ Styles since I can't use him for like two weeks anyway. You know, I That's... figure uh, giving him an extra six stamina will be, you know, make it so I don't, you know, he can, he'll be around longer when he comes back. Okay. Um. Anybody else you want? And. Um... I'm going to save homecoming for a bit, you know, because uh, I have a bunch of people that are around for another four weeks. Okay. I want to see how they do, you know, like wait to see if they got the stuff to be permanent members. Okay. Um, do you want to play any others or do you want, are you, are you cool with not spending any more? Um, yeah, I think I'm good for now. You want to buy any? Uh, no, I don't think so. Well, actually, wait, hang on. Um, injury rehab for three hundred thousand. Um, thirty thousand. <clears throat> oh yeah, that's, that's, that's what I meant. Yeah, definitely not three hundred thousand. Uh, yeah, that's worth it, you know, because uh, I got a lot of people on low stamina. I'm probably gonna need it eventually sooner or oh, later. Start. Um, you could use a logistic. You could upgrade something. You want to see what you can upgrade or no? Uh, no, I'm okay. Okay. Book your show then. All right. Tell me when you're ready. And... So just catch it up. What yeah, I'm waiting for today? some torch to catch up. I'm going to say Twitch is doing really well. It chooses this time to be slow. Yeah. Okay. So, um, because you brought up um, Lorenzo's going to throw a hissy fit, um, my main event will be Lorenzo versus Gunther. That's for the belt. Yep, for the belt. Uh, there's a regular match, or do you want to do it like a stipulation? Uh, yeah, I'm going to make it a stipulation. Okay, what time is it? Well, I got to wait for Twitch to catch up now, don't I? Okay, you do. Why when I said Twitch was doing well, it starts like not doing well. Yeah. Yeah, oh, AJ's not doing great on stamina. But, um, you know, it, that's fine. Hopefully he'll be okay. Uh, hmm. I'm trying to think of what would be decent for, like, so he wouldn't get injured, you know? Uh, uh, tables match, because that's slow stamina cost. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. It's low, low cost and low stamina. Yeah, I'm gonna go with tables. And um, isn't there specialty staminas? Uh, not table <laughs> stamina tables. What are these specialty tables? No, no, I, I could have sworn uh, one of them like their specialty. Like, oh yeah, I, I can't remember who. I, I have someone who's like specialty like matches yeah, like it's, tables. It's, I actually didn't even know it's it's. It's Lorenzo that's actually good in tables matches, so that's that's good. Okay, cool. Yeah, so I, I was right. Nice, cool. It's been like two months, but I remembered. Yep. Um, I forgot though, so that's that good that you remembered. Yeah. All right. What else do you want to book? <laughs> okay, so, uh, my opener, I'm thinking I haven't done a tag match in a long. Uh, yeah, yeah, because um. Um, because yeah, I'm pretty sure one of my requirements for this week is to do a tag match, right? Yep. 
Okay, so I'm going to do uh, the tag match as the opener. And, uh, you know, once I can see my, who my, my roster, then I will let you know who I'm picking. Yeah, so. Uh, Joe wants some rematch against The Undertaker. Do you think that's okay if it's uh, a tag match, or would he be like, no, you know, only it just has know, to be a rematch. You know, it just has to be a rematch. Um, okay, cool, cool. Match. So it doesn't matter if it's tag match. Cool, great. Two birds, one stone. So that's going to be. Oh wait, fuck! I, I got to remember who uh, who can fight against who. So specialists can fight everyone. Yeah. Uh, I wrote it down, but I don't have paper on me. It's what bruisers versus uh, giants. Bruisers versus fighters. Bruises versus fires, giants against cruisers. Yeah. Okay, so. Who is Joe? We look at uh, yeah. With? Joe's a cruiser, so he can fight. Um, giants. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. So, yeah. Br bruisers versus um, fighters, cruisers versus giants, right? Yeah. Okay, yeah. So he can fight a giant. Okay. Um, so he's going to team up with He's going to team up with uh Giovanni. Okay. Who's who are they going to fight? Well, you said Undertaker, who's Undertaker going to team up with? Um He's going to team up with um, Dante Roberts. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah, that should match up good. So, yeah, because Undertaker is a giant. Giants can fight cruisers. So, it's two cruisers, a specialist, and a giant. So, yeah, that, that should be fine. Over, but you can't do anything about it because you don't have the law. So, to really do anything about it is that Undertaker and um, Dante Roberts are faces and Joe Wheeler's a face. So, that. I, you you kind of have to go with this match and just hope it's good because you're lost. Well, isn't it like you're supposed to like faces versus um, heels? Yeah, but the problem is, is uh, Joe Wheel is a face and Undertaker and Dante Roberts are faces. So, um, no, no, it's two um, Giovanni and Joel are uh, heels. Oh, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't realize that. Okay, so you're right, actually. I thought Joe Wheeler was a face. So, um, but you know. Okay, cool. I got worried for a second. Um, so my mid card, uh, probably do a women's one since we got two guys. Um, let me look at my uh, my uh, who my promises again, just to make sure I'm not fucking anyone over. Um, <clears throat> yeah, AJ has two weeks off. Uh, wait, hand. Um, he said, okay, my requirement is a tornado tag match. Uh, is that different from a regular tag match? Yeah, you did a I, I did a tornado for you. Uh, so okay, cool, cool. Again, wrestling noob. I, I don't know jack shit about wrestling. So, you know, I'm, I'm the newbie with that. Uh, for a woman, you don't have any, like, requirements. Um, I think you fulfilled all your requirements. Everything else is just about contract. The only thing you can't do is you, you just have to, you just can't book AJ this week. And, and you can't book him in anything. Yeah. You can't do, you can't do it. I don't yeah, yeah. Do it. I'm double, I'm double, I'm double checking. Yeah. Yeah. It, those are the only two requirements is the Undertaker rematch, AJ has to rest, and, um, you know, Lorenzo has to get his chain back again just to lose it immediately. <laughs> um, hey, you might not even win the match. Uh, yeah, I know, right? Um, we'll see. I, you know, it, it We'll see. We'll see. Um, well, yeah, I'm pretty sure he can't win because I, I gave Gunther the uh, the power card, you know, for like the champions are going to win. Oh, yeah. So um, he's not going to win. Yeah, no, I know. Uh, that's fine. Uh, Gunther can hold the belt for a bit. While. Yeah. So, um, yeah. Okay. So, so I'm pretty good on all my, um, on all my um, promises. So, um, on, on Twitch, can you go back to the roster? Yeah, I just did, so it's taking a minute. Okay, cool. Yeah. Do 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 to do do do. Hi, Dingo. Yep. Yeah. Uh, my dog's attacking me right now. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. 
There we go. Uh, I'm going to do uh, Cindy Fluff versus Bailey or no? Uh, Yeah, because they do have a rivalry, I'm pretty sure. Uh, yeah, yeah, we're going to do... Yeah, they both got decent stamina. Actually, um, you know what? No, we're going to do... Oh, yeah, no, no, they're both heels. Yeah, yeah, we're going to do uh, Cindy Fluff versus Bailey. yeah. And... Uh, Stipulation or no? Nah, nah, I don't want it to overshadow the uh, other two. Oh, God. And you have another mid-card? Yep. Yeah, well, you know, got Twitch has got a member. I'm I'm on the other side of the East Coast, so this will take yeah. a minute. It yeah, better, you forgot actually. that I that I live like super far away from you. How'd you forget that? No, I forgot that it takes actually a long time. Yeah. Uh, sorry, I got a phone call and I had to uh, cancel it. Uh, the joys of doing this on my phone. Um, this next one is going to be. Uh, Triton versus Bra uh, we know Cruiser versus Giant. Yeah, Cruisers can fight Giants. This one's gonna be Brian White versus Triton. Oh, Bray Wyatt, you mean? Yeah, Bray Wyatt. Sorry, the English. Bruiser, Again, I worked a ten-hour shift today. Give me some credit. Um, Bray Wyatt's a Bruiser. You still want to do it? Oh, you're right. No, yeah, he's a Bruiser. Sorry, I thought he's. I thought it's a Cruiser. Apparently, I'm going blind too. Um. Just assign someone for a week, um, or you could just do the Bray Wyatt match and just say fuck it. Okay, well, yeah, wait, bra uh, Bruiser's fight uh, against fighters. Okay, so we're gonna do Randy Orton versus Timber. Okay. Maybe start a rivalry. Okay. Um, just a regular match. Yep, regular match. Uh, I can do your promos. Tell me when you're ready. Yep. So. Uh, Triton's uh, popularity is already shit, so we're gonna have him do a advertisement. Okay. <laughs> just, by, just you know, if it, if it's already crap, just have it go down even more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get some money out of it at least. Yeah, yeah. I I got I originally got Triton because he you know it only costs like five bucks and a pack of gum to get him to sign on, you know. Yeah. So you know, we we get him we give him what he's worth. So uh, once I see the options for advertisement, I shall pick with one. Oh, I already did that. It's just taking. Okay, time. cool. Um, so let's see. We're gonna do. Hmm. Okay, yeah, Tegan definitely needs the stamina. Okay, so who can? Well, Tegan, you can't use Tegan or AJ. Okay, anymore. everyone else is pretty good in stamina. Uh, we're yeah, we're gonna do Nia Jax for the self promo. Okay. One more promo. Yep. And what's the other what's the other kind of promos besides um, advertisement and self promo? Uh, call out promo, role change, charity, class change, training, or tag team call out. Okay. Um, you know what? Rhea is gonna call out Tegan. Yeah, Bruiser versus Fighter. Yeah, yeah, that works. All right. Let's go through the show. You know, make sure you, it's everything you want. We have the uh, Tornado Tag Team match. It's Joe Wheeler and Giovanni Vinci versus Undertaker and Dante Roberts. Are you going to be cool with that, or do you not want that match anymore? No, that's fine. I, I'm, unless this is you, like, hinting at me, like, I don't know. Dude, that's kind of shit. Um, but no, I, I, think, I think that's okay. Yeah, I, um, I'm not doing that at all because... Uh, if you remember, I'm do I do this at the end of after everyone does the show now yeah, because yeah. uh because because I fucked over John that one week and then go over it. So yeah. I, sure. I I disgraced myself from going from the silver medal down all the way to fourth place, so I got to redeem myself this week. Well, I got to get forget, at least I, back to bronze. Well, don't forget, no matter I get two percent of your fans this week, no matter what. So uh, yeah, thanks. Yeah. So then we have the advertising promo by Triton. Do you still want to do that? Yep. 
Uh, then we have uh, Cindy Fluff versus Bailey. Do you still want to do that? Yep. Then we have the self promo by Nia Jax. I don't know why her thin look. By the way, do you think Nia Jax is real, a real person or fake based on this picture? Uh, she looks fake. She is real. I don't know why they picked this picture, but uh, Chris, you see really because like yeah, yeah, the model like it's not like an actual picture. Like I don't it's know like, why they, yeah. I don't know why they did did this. Um, they were like, hey Nia, can we like use a picture of you for our video game? And she was like, no, fuck you. I would be shocked. Uh, then we have uh, <laughs> the, the next mid card. It's Tim Bo versus Randy Orton. You cool with that or not? Nah? Yeah, that's fine. Then we have uh, Leah Ripley calling out Tegan Knox. Are you cool with that? Yep. A lot of fighters versus bruisers this week. Yeah. Uh, and then we have the title match. It's uh, Gunther defending against Shannon Saxon on the tables match. Are you okay with that? Yep. Right, well, before we confirm, just to make 100% sure, I got it. I got the tight matchups right. It's Giants versus Cruisers and Fighters versus Bruisers, right? Yep. Okay. Uh, specialist, specialist versus Specialist. I if I got that line. wrong, this week is real fucked up. And then Cruiser and Specialist, Giant and Cruiser. Yeah, I think you have all the classes right. Okay. Yeah, everything's good. Uh, all right, great, great. I'm going to confirm this booking. Great, sounds good. Well, uh, I All guess right, I'll Chris. shut up now. So, uh, number three, you're up. Oh, boy. All right, Chris. Now, remember, you can uh, pick what order you want to answer these emails in. So just tell me whatever you want to answer first, and we'll do it. Because so, that's a new thing I learned now. We'll just do them in order. I don't care. Okay. I have Captain Gorg. He says, hey, my contract is up at the end of the week. Can't say I've been loving... It, but I'll be prepared to stay another five weeks for 16k. You have you're not 17- worth that. Get the fuck off my brand. <laughs> so thank okay. So thanks for your work, Captain Gorg. But I won't be with you in the contract. Hey, at least <laughs> at least at least the game can pick what you say. Because if you had said that to him, and he says I, <laughs> I said I understand. This will be my final week at Raw, so you can still book him this week. You just you're, oh yeah, I'm get squashed. Uh, Triple H said something. Not my you. luck. He'd probably win. Listen, you need to take better care of your superstars. I understand sometimes they need to uh, they need to be in a big match, but make sure to plan around that. I'm giving you a health spa power card. Use it to give um, one of your superstars a well-needed rest. Some power cards can help with keeping your stars off the injured list. It's too late for Cody. You'll have to wait until he's recovered, but try to make sure that other stars on your roster get, uh, don't get... I almost, said, I almost said get injured instead of don't get injured. That would have been bad. <laughs> Just make sure they get... Um, okay, so you just got a power card for one so, week. So, Triple H wants me to take care of my superstars, but yet every week he makes me do a fucking stupid thing where they get hurt. Yeah, pretty much. I don't know. Contradictory. Um, it's big E. Listen, I'm not feeling 100% right now. I don't mind pain, but I don't want a serious injury. Is it okay if uh, I take... You can take as much time off as you want. Okay, so I get some rest, Big E. So you don't have them for two weeks. Thanks, boss. I appreciate it. Anything to keep you happy. I want that neck as strong as physically possible. There you go. Uh, EO Sky says, good that you didn't screw me on that promise. Keep this up, and I'll probably stay at war. Glad I joined war. It's great. It's going well at the moment. So, uh, EO Sky got a small increase to her morale. Thanks to you, buddy. Fuck oh, yeah, let's go. All right, let's look at your shakeups. Tell me when you're ready, and then, uh, you know. Yeah. So, you have Cruiser PR training. All of your Cruiser superstars get plus three mic skill. You have room for all. Select a giant superstar. They set out the next three shows while your fighters and bruisers increase match card quality. Keep them happy and sele- select a superstar to maximize their morale. That's his instant, and the others you have like five weeks to do it, so you can pick which one you want to use. That's tough. That's tough. I'm not telling you anything either. I'm not going to be as helpful as I am to AJ and John. Because you're an, you're an ass. You've played this uh, game before. You know what you're doing. Barely. Hmm. I'll do. Hmm. Damn. I'll do room for all. 
Which giant's gonna sit out for three weeks? The Red Flame or Raquel Rodriguez? I was gonna say I don't have them. It's the fucking Red Flame, baby. The legend. He's the the next, he sitting out for the next three weeks, or is it gonna be Raquel Rodriguez? It's gonna be him. He said you can't use him for three weeks. I just want to make sure. Yes. I, all right. He could use it. Look at him. He's. All right. He's gonna so die. Let's take a look. Um, at your journal. So, um, you 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 told Cody he'd partner with Trick Williams in a tag match within the next three weeks. I think my my other cousin did that for you. Um, so he get he 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 stayed happy. You can't book Big E for two weeks. Uh, Captain Gorg's contract is up. Uh, I think Neon, Cody got hurt last time. Yeah. Neon Bright I think Star Cody expires. Um, her contract expires at the end of week four. Uh, Seth Rollins' contract expires at the end of in four weeks, and everything else. Uh, Brooks Jensen's yeah, contract expires in five for weeks for a while. Also. Take a look at Commissioner going. It says, do not book your most popular specialist this week. So we'll have to look to see who that is. And that would be that, Cody, I think, right? Uh, yeah, but I think it's available, typically. So, um, And the, uh, to the moon, you get only usable on superstars with less than t uh, 60 popularity plus 15 popularity to a superstar after the next match. So let's take a look at your season challenges. Um, you haven't done a lot, I don't think. You have to book 10 shows. Uh, like you're in me too. Uh, you book 10 shows with yeah. GM interference. Uh, how many uh, How many for 10 shows with all promos? I have five of those. Yeah, five so. of those. So you have to book 10 shows. You could, do that, I could do that relatively easily. Yeah. Yep. Uh, but, uh, you have to book 10 shows with a charity promo. 10 shows with a call-out promo, 10 shows with a self-promo. You have to use 50 talent scouts. You have to you have to book 10 shows with an advertising promo. Use three power cards during one week. You did that once. You have to renew the contract of five superstars. So you should have renewed Captain Gorgs or else you would have had this more completed. So that's, that's on you. Uh, you have to book He's 10 not shows worth it. with a tag team call-up. I, I, I don't know. Now, now that I'm seeing this again, I remember uh, a lot of your... Season challenges with all you have, you basically have to use one of those promo types at least a few times. Um, yeah. So what do you want to do? Do you want to book a show first? You want to go logistics? You want to go to your power cards? Um, let's book it and then we'll go. We'll we'll look at the cards after and the logistics. Uh, before we do that, let's go to your roster and see who your most popular specialist is because I think. Yeah. Because I don't know who it book, is. You 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 can't. Let me. What's the commissioner goal? Yeah, it is Cody. Yeah, but he's uh I would recommend yeah. uh Alexa so, Bliss can't book Bliss. No, you can book Bliss. I recommend don't book Seth. Because usually they say uh available and you can't book Cody anyway, so I recommend you Seth. Because Alexa's an eighty one in popularity right now. Uh but she's a cruiser though, it's most popular specialist. Oh specialist, yeah. And it's Seth. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got you. Yeah, I'm gonna book it. You want to check your power cards though? Maybe you can bring Cody back, and then you couldn't book Cody. At the, you wouldn't be able to book Cody this week, anyways. I wouldn't be able to book him anyway, so there's no point. Okay. Well, let's book the show. What do you want to do? Uh, let's see. I'm really handcuffed this week because I don't have my fucking. Ch I don't have my actual champion. You don't have. Um, you, you don't. You don't have Biggie or Cody, and I think the. Yeah. You, you <laughs> like, like championship wise, uh, who I forget how my tag team champions are. Um, tag, the woman's tag champions. I might do that for the fuck. I might do that as the main. Angel Gaza and Humberto Carrillo. Okay, I'll do that as the main against. Uh, I gotta find. I gotta look. I gotta see who the two phases would be. They're both cruisers, so. But you don't. I know you don't care about that, so. Not a fucking iota. Um. We'll do. God damn it! Trick. Okay. 
God damn it. I would love to put Seth in that spot. I can't risk it though. Um, I want to, I'm going to sign, I'm going to sign someone. I need to sign a bunch of people. You have power cards for that. Um, you do not. You do not have a power card for that. Let's see who you can sign. Uh, let me know when you're ready. We'll look at the signings. Uh, I want to, let's, hmm, let's You have five see. talent scouts, so. Go up one level. Um, do you want to just do any, like gender, uh, or do you want to, are you looking for any, a specific gender? Any, any gender, just in case if I need women to. Okay. Any wool, face or heel, you don't care? Uh, faces. Because I need a face, team to face, uh, I need another face, a couple can't, faces. You can't, I, I assume you don't care about class, because you don't, you don't want to do that anyway, so. Let's do it, let's use these scouts up. All right, so you got Apollo Cruz and Will Osprey. Will Osprey, Katana Chance, Thea Hale. Um, we'll sign Apollo. Apollo on. Let's uh, let's see what the f hmm. Yeah, we'll do it for five weeks. That's some fifty k. Do you want to sign somebody else? Uh, we'll do Osprey. You gotta pay the. How long are you gonna sign Will Osprey for? We'll do that for five weeks too. I do have to ask. That's... How long do you think? Uh, I mean, to be fair, AEW signed him for longer. Do you think AEW spent more money than uh, you're gonna spend on Will Osprey because he's forty thousand? He's forty thousand. Uh, yes, I would think so. Yes. All right, anybody else you want to sign? Um. Let's uh, let's jump on these. Win uh, Katana Chance and Thea Hale. That's it. You have to spend money on Katana Chance. How does that feel? Uh, fucking terrible. But I I don't want to go up level. Five weeks. Um, yeah, we'll do five weeks for both of them. That's not too much. I can. I'll make I'll make that back. All right. Let's go book this show. Do you, want to, do you want to use your logistics up, too? You have some logistics you can do. You want to look at a show first and then see if you can have the, enough money for it. Yeah, I think I'll pass on, on, on them. Yeah, the one thing I don't like is that they make you use them. That's the one thing I don't like about in this game. Oh, like you like you can't go back to high school gym if you want to? Yeah, you can't You can't go back and save your money. You have to keep using the $50,000 one every time. Yeah, that sucks. I really, I, I, I don't like that. Yeah. You should be like able the, to I, choose. I don't like the scouts. I liked it, but it was like, you could use anybody. Yeah, I, the scouts, I mean, it was kind of cool at first, but it kind of gets annoying after a while. Yeah, yeah who and Angel Garza and Alberto Carrillo are going to defend their Well, it'll just um, fight. But it, it might be a non-title match. So it's, trick. It's we'll do Trick and Apollo. The title match? Yeah, we'll do it for the titles. Right, what else are you doing? Um, we'll do Osprey versus Jensen to start it out. Open it with I gotta get the. I get. I don't care if they don't like it. They won't like this. Um, just a regular match. Yeah, I guess Jensen's really low in stamina, and I don't want to kill him. What else are you doing? Uh, we got to get some women in here, so we'll do, I can't, I'm not going to, uh, we'll do a woman's tag match for the women's tag titles. How about this match? Or do you want to change it? Um, take Raquel out, because she's a 14 stamina. Uh, Who is, uh, feud someone. I can't risk it. Um, Jump White Sox got a team with instead. Uh, we'll we'll throw in we'll we'll give it to EO. No, actually, no, because that's not. Um, that'd be stupid because that's not. She's not a face. Uh, we'll do Katana because she's got more stamina. That makes a little bit more sense. You want the belt on the line? Actually. 
Actually, we'll do Katana and Thea with the belts on the line. Do you want to swap this and make this the opener since it's a title match, or do you want to just keep it with it? Yeah, because I yeah, because I feel like that could overshadow it. I don't want to. I know I I ran into that problem the last time. Uh, what else? Uh, let's see. Um, let's do Mello versus Captain Gorg. You better fucking win. Mellow or Captain Gorg? You have some promos you can do now. Um, we'll do because I can. I think I can put Seth in a promo, right? It's just a match, right? Yes. No, not fulfilled. Right. So yes, we have to entirely. Um, yeah, you got you got kind of screwed over. You got do not book, and while well, John got don't put this person in the match. Yeah, that's. That's cool. Uh, I can deal with it for this week. Um, we'll do Raquel, and we'll do an advertising promo because I need to. I need to chop. I need to take one of those. Um, charity, I think, was one of them. We'll do a yeah. charity. Charity promo. We'll throw Neon Bright Star in that role. One more promo. We'll do a um it's either between EO or 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 Pete Dunn. I don't know which one I want to do here. Which one has the better promo skill? John's got three. Eo's got three. <laughs> well, we'll throw we'll throw in the uh, the 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 Petey boy, the Pete what man. Kind of promos he gonna do? We'll do we'll do we'll throw in another advertising promo. You want to check your power cards? Or, you can... or yeah, advertising. Yeah. You want to check your power cards? See what you can use. Now let's let's take a quick peek. We have this is war, which can select an opposer brand. You have three randomly selected stars that cannot be booked in matches next week. Ooh, Ooh. that's interesting. Got to do that. Ah, uh, <laughs> I have two of those, so uh, that's still uh, pretty much busy. Reduces the probability that a superstar will become injured in a match. Yeah, I think I want to use one of those. I want uh, on who? Hundred percent. Big. Uh, let's see. Let me change the thin the stamina. Well, you can't. Put let's see who needs it. Uh, you uh, can put Macau back in that match and play this on, and then she won't get injured. Um, uh, Brooks Jensen. At the twenty nine stamina there, I just I just don't want to risk him getting hurt. Yeah, um, yeah, uh, but do you want to use the this is war because you you were kind of tempted on that one. Ah, uh, mm, not yet. Yeah. Well, remember you can't I, use it before PLE this time. So if you if you ever gonna use it, you have to. Yeah. Use it. I'm gonna do. I, I'm. I'm. I'm gonna use it, but not right now. I just. Feel champ. You can block an opposing brand for booking one of the current champions next week. Sh on next week's show. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go with the with the with the with the, with the, uh, with the one power card there. Oh, you don't want to book anymore? No, I'm good. I'm good with the power cards right now. Right, let's go through your show. Make sure you you're cool with it. For the opener, we have the women's tag title match. Alexa Bliss and Tiffany Stratton defended against Katana Chance and Thea Hale. You cool with that match? Yeah. You have uh, Raquel Rodriguez doing an advertising promo. You cool with that? Yep. Then you have Brooks Jensen versus Will Ospreay. You cool with that match? Yep. Then we have uh, Neon Brightstar doing a charity promo. You cool with that? Yep. Then we have uh, Camilla Hayes versus Captain Gorg. You cool with that? Yep. And then we have uh, Pete Dunn doing an advertising promo. You cool with that? Yep. 
What if, what's Pete Dunn going to advertise? Tell me. Tell me what he's going to advertise. What he's going to advertise that he's no longer Butch. What's that? What Cowboy Vega is going to advertise? That she's a good, uh, good old human being. And what about charity? What 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 cha- what charity is Neon Dwight Star supporting? The one that goes right into her pocket. And then we have the main event for the War Tag Team Championships. It's Angel Garza and Alberto Carrillo versus Trick Williams and Apollo Crews. You cool with that match? Yeah. All right. I'm going to hit confirm book. And once I hit that, can't go back. You cool, you cool with this? Yeah. All right, AJ. John, I'm up. So once I'm done, we're going to be sending that. Oh, whoa, oh, what happened? Oh, yeah. Wait. I forgot. This was played on me already. So I can't. I have to go <laughs> to. This actually might help me, though, because. Uh, Remember, I remember I don't have a lot of money, so this actually, this is, in a weird way, AG actually helped me here, so. Uh, yeah. Um, okay, so. Glad to have a point. Hey, OMF, you're probably aware of the fact that Natalia keeps hiding my gym bag. She seems to think it's hilarious. I don't. I've had enough of a consistent disrespect, and I want to teach her a lesson in the wind. And I promise you I'm going to Good in the heat. Damn it. Uh, yeah, an instant rivalry. <laughs> Sounds good. You can fight her this week. I'm sorry to hear you about your problems, Leo. Um, he hit my gym bag. But oh. you have to handle uh, How those 2005 of them. At least for now. I already have a show booked. And this kind of... I, already, I had a plan to be on the show anyways, but it's like I already have my yeah. show booked. So, and I'm not going to change my show because Leah Davenport wants to have a, you know, a match because the That's 2005 hits. of them. Yeah. So yeah, I'm going to say, I'm so, I think I'm the first one to say no. I'm, I'm going to say no. So I'm going to say no. Fine. But when you ignore um, a problem like her, things will only get worse. I'm pulling Tony Khan and I'm ignoring the fact that someone <laughs> could be a problem in the locker room. Oh, just faster. No big deal. <laughs> I got an email about an agency in the area. This is from Triple H, by the way. How do you feel about uh, giving them a chance? They are currently charging 10 k for a three-week ad campaign. It has the potential to gain us some new fans, but they, uh, but since there's new, new, uh, new, there's always potential to lose some as well. Not right now. I feel it's a bit too risky. Can't pass that that deal. Uh, let's get it in the books. I don't think I need to do that because I'm winning anyways. I'm I'm way ahead of you guys, so it's like I'm basically yeah, spending. It's only paying. Oh wow, not you know way to be humble. Say that. Say that again, Chris. It's only ten thousand. I have I have four hundred thousand. I mean, you couldn't pass that up. That's only ten thousand. Yeah, I'm gonna take it. Can't pass that up. Um, let's get it in the books. Let's do it. Sounds good. I'll update you next week. Okay, let's take a look to see what I can do. Uh, I I did learn it, since I'm winning, I, these wins aren't going to help me that much because uh, you know I'm already winning anyway. So we have face You're off. Tough, yeah. We have all active rivalries are increased to level four, but I'm pretty sure all my rivalries, I they I, that doesn't really help me because um, most of them blew off at the pay per view, so that's really needed um gain 15k fans from shows where superstars are injured um okay and it's specialized that shows matches with only specialized have boosted quality but all but all uh participants lose extra stamina i think that's a no brainer which one i'm gonna use i'm gonna use bloodthirsty fans because uh i'm not gonna do specialized shows because uh then um you know even though uh, the match quality gets boosted, um, I don't want to take a risk of like my wrestlers getting losing extra stamina. So I'm going to do bloodthirsty fans. But I don't know how to do this now. Do I actually want my wrestlers to get injured? Like, how does that work? Like, yeah, your fans are bloodthirsty. Yeah. All right, so let's take a look at what I have to do this week. So I have to book. I promised Sammy Vortex a rematch against Shotzi within two weeks. I have to do that this week. I told Chelsea Green she partnered with Sammy Vortex in a tag match within the next three weeks. I have to do that this week. Uh, Pop quiz. Uh, I told AJ recently, so I think he remembers. But Chris, do you remember what Chelsea Green's stamina was at? 
I don't. It's zero. Well, I was gonna say it was the, definitely low. Yeah. I would have to guess like five times, and I and it was like no lower, lower, lower zero. Like, are you shitting me? And I have to schedule one into one of my champions this week, and I get bad timing. I don't think I need bad timing. I think I think you guys have suffered enough with the bad timing. I don't think you guys need that. Um, I'll see if I can schedule a one in. Maybe a side of rivalry. Let's take a look at my power cards. Um, I don't need to play network special because uh, I might get something out of that. Injury rehab. Um, I don't think anyone's injured. Nobody's injured. But isn't that that's very rare? And typically, uh, I always have a someone that's injured. So, um, get schooled. So like two percent of loss, they immediately gain thirty win experience. I'm gonna play that on Sammy Vortex. See what happens. And then uh, contract negotiations. See, Brutus Creed has like how uh, I think that says six weeks, five weeks. So I don't need to play this yet. I'm good. Uh, manage roster. I can go update this perk right here. So we'll do last man standing match. Update that. And that's it. All I can do. And I must just released her by accident. More than bad. But let's book the show. Um, have a nice. I've been. I've had this show in the can for a while, so I'm pretty happy about this. So I'm going to book. Um, because they're in a rivalry. I'm gonna. Uh, it was originally the opener, but I'm gonna make it the main event. It's a last man standing match. It's gonna be Chad Gable versus Sheamus. Then we're gonna do tag team match. For the belts, we have Natalia and uh, we have Chelsea Green and Sammy Vortex versus Natalia and Shotzi for the women's tag team championships. Um, do I, have, I didn't even check to see if I could buy a power card, which I cannot do. But you, the beauty is, is if Chelsea Green gets injured, I can just play the injury we have card and hopefully bring her back. Let's just hope she doesn't get injured for more than three weeks. Um, then I'm going to do my promos. Uh, Blonde Strowman's going to call out. Um, scripts because they're in a rivalry. Um, we're gonna have uh, it's not what I wanted. We're gonna have uh, Brutus Creed versus Drew Gulak. Then we're gonna have I'm gonna get a rivalry going. I'm gonna have Julia call out Bianca Belair. Um, then we're gonna have Blair Davenport versus a baby face. Um, might just be, well, I don't want to do Bianca because the stamina is a 20, so this is where I'm going to go sign somebody. Um, let's see if I can actually get, like, a decent woman out of this. And I can sign any woman, which is the beauty part of it, so. Let's do, I believe, play that with what's a specialist. Yes, yeah, so let's do... Let's do Ivy Nile for five weeks. I was going to sign a job, but why not? I, I, you know, if I have the money, why not spend it a little bit? Uh, and then we're going to do uh, Finn Bal. I did say to, oh, I can't sign. I was going to sign a baby. I was going to find a face. And I, do I have enough talent scouts to sign a face, a baby face? What if I should make a star? Um. Establish stars, male. Can't do it. We're gonna do, I don't think we need to do anything with Finn Balor. I'm going to book him. Finn Balor is going to do a self promo. I don't think I need to do any logistics. I think I'm okay there. Oh, I can't. I can't. I can't do Roku at all. The by the email campaign. Uh, should I schedule a one in on somebody? I really can't. Nah, I'm not gonna do the commissioner role. 
I think I'm good. Um, it's going to be my show. I'm going to make sure I have it all laid out. I did check. I never checked my season challenges. I want to make sure I check those. You have to book 15 shows without an injury. I'm not going to do that because Chelsea Green is going to get injured. I have to book 10 last man standing match. I booked one. I have to purchase all power cards before a show five times. Uh, what can I get for power cards? I mean, nothing. Spectacular. Um, I have to gain 225 uh, popularity between all of your roster. Book 10 TLC matches. I thought I did that one week, but I guess I haven't done that yet. Book 10 shows with a call up promo. So I did a couple call up promos. I think that was why I booked that. Book 10 shows with a perfect drama curve. Let's hope I can do that. Change the world of 10 superstars with the world change promo. I got to use that. I use 50, use 50 talent scouts. I think I used two of them. And I did book 10 shows with a false count anywhere match. Ooh, false count anywhere. For the maps? That's just. Oh, okay, that would have been helpful. Okay. I'm going to confirm this book, and I'm pretty confident with this show. All right, let's see how you guys' shows turned out. So, John, you're starting. Let me know uh, when you're ready for me to start simming your matches. You're just going to unmute yourself. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm ready. So we have Tamina versus Mercedes Monet. Let's see who wins this match. Tamina wins. It was a good match. Three stars. Good job, John. Good enough. Uh, JBL did a self promo. It was good. His popularity went up by one. Um, we have Ignition versus Rhea Ripley. Let's see who wins this match. Um, Ignition wins. Disappointed, but he didn't overshadow your opener, so... Yeah, Ignition beat Rhea Ripley, John. How do you feel about that? Uh, uh, Stone Cold Steve Austin called out Roman Reigns, and it was a weak, weak promo by Stone Cold Steve Austin tonight. It was weak. So <laughs> That's such bullshit. <laughs> I guess Stone Cold had a bad night. Uh, then we have Matt Jackson versus Adrian Williams. Let's see who wins this. It's Matt Jackson. And it was dull. But you have a new rivalry, but it doesn't matter because Adrian Williams isn't going to be around the next episode. Uh, then we have Becky Lynch doing a self promo. It was okay. Her popularity went up by one. Then we have Roman Reigns versus Shawn Michaels. And Shawn Michaels wins. Uh, mediocre. Two stars. Uh, so we'll have to wait and see how your show does right there, John. All right, AJ, let me know when you're ready. I'll start simming your matches. I'm ready. I'm ready. All right, so we have the Tornado Tag Match, Joe Wheelie and Giovanni Vinci versus Undertaker and uh, Dante Roberts. Let's see who wins this. It's Joe Wheelie and Giovanni Vinci. It was a good match, new rivalry. Uh, good job, AJ. Good, good opener. Uh, Woohoo, all right. Tyson promo. It was weak. He got you $1,000, and his popularity went down by seven. Um, wow, 1000 bucks for a $7 hit. That's Triton for you. Classic Triton. No, seven, he, he, he lost his popularity. So uh, Then we have uh, yeah. Cindy Fluff versus Bailey. And Bailey wins. Because Mediocre and the rivalry goes from level one to level two. Okay, that's nice. At least it went up. Um, and then we have uh, Nia Jack. She had a weak promo. And uh, she did, her popularity didn't go up at all. So, uh, yeah, good go. for her. Damn, shitty promos this week. Well, Nia Jax is known for doing shitty promos IOL, so. Um, oh. <laughs> All right, cool. So I'm being consistent. So then Timber versus Ray Well, that's that, that's obviously a, a subjective, but a, uh, that's my opinion anyways, so. No, oh, and it's fact. Clearly, it's it's a factual opinion. Then we have uh, Timber versus Randy Orton, um, and Randy Orton wins in a disappointed match. Wow, oh, man. Okay, well, at least it was the mid-fight that was disappointing, I guess. Yeah, we were definitely calling out uh, Tegan Knox. It was an okay promo, but it didn't it didn't start a rivalry, so there you go. Um, Damn it. Then we have Gunther versus uh, Chanted Stacks Lorenzo. Um, and there Gunther it retains, is. Which obviously was going to happen, and Chanted Stacks Lorenzo's injured. No, real surprise, I'm sure. 
I'm sure all the people who bet money on it are are um, real surprised by it. That's amazing, though. But did you hear what I said? Shannon Sachs with Avengers injured for two weeks now. Yeah, yeah, I kind of figured. That I, was the first time I heard that name called. Yeah. No, this this is the first injury I've had, so I, I could still get the 15 shows without injury pretty easily. We're only on week six. But, but Chris, you, you, I, I have said that name before. You, you, you were there for that one. I was there, but that was the first time I was called unprompted. Yep. All right, Chris, let me know when you're ready for me to start simming your matches. Oh, I'm ready. Oh, you have the women's tag team match, Alexa Bliss and Tiffany Stratton defending against uh, Katana Chance and Thea Hale. Um, Alexa Bliss and Tiffany Stratton retained. It was an okay match. It's okay. Two and a half stars. But Carla Vegas did have advertised it for She got you $9,500, but her popularity went down by seven. Um, then how that's possible? And then we have Brooks Jensen versus Will Ospreay. Um, let's see here what, what what happens here. Brooks they Jensen might like wins. this. Disappointing. Disappointing. So we have Neon Brightstar. God damn it, it, Brooks Jensen! You cut an embarrassing promo, and uh, but you got your seven hundred fifty uh, fans. I don't know how that equates to seven hundred fifty fans if it's embarrassing. Maybe it's so embarrassing people had to see it. Um, Carmelo Hayes versus Captain Gorg. I gotta like um, it, so I don't care. Carmelo Hayes wins. It was dull. It's not good. So, yeah, I knew that was gonna be dull. Then we have Pete Dunn um, doing. He did an excellent promo. He got you ten thousand five hundred fans, and his popularity went down by two. Then we have the Raw Tag Title match: Angel Garza and Alberto Carrillo versus Trick Williams and Apollo Cruz. Um, new champions. Trick Williams and Apollo Cruz won the belts. It was a good match. You have a new, you got a rivalry out of that, so it's good stuff, Chris. You might actually have a good show this week. There we go. There we go. I wasn't banking on that becoming a rivalry, but okay. Yeah. So I I have the women's tag title match. It's Chelsea Green and Sammy Vortex versus Natalia and Shotzi. I kind of hope we don't get new champions here. We didn't. Thank God. Someone's gonna die. Ooh, ooh, Shotzi and Chelsea Green got injured for three weeks. I didn't know they were both getting oh, injured. I just lost my, <laughs> I just lost my uh, two champions in the span of one match. Um, <laughs> oh, I didn't. Good I didn't lord. Anticipate, yeah, I didn't anticipate that, but whatever. Braun Strowman's calling out uh, scripts, and it, the rivalry grows from level three to level four, so that's good. We have Brutus Creed versus uh, Drew Gulak. But we just take advantage of him in the ring. Drew Gulak won. Maybe that's why he won. It was disappointing. I got a rivalry out of that, though. <laughs> new rivalry. So I kind of didn't think that would be great. I just needed a match, though. So um, then we have Julio calling out Bianca Belair. And it started a new rivalry. It was an okay promo, but I just wanted a rivalry out of that. Then we have uh, Blair Davenport versus Ivy Nile. Um, Blair Davenport wins in a disappointing match. I got a rivalry out of that, though. Finn Balor cuts a promo. It was she can't find her bag. Yeah, I can't find it. Her popular went up by three. Oh, you know what? Oh, no, I was going to say, I could have had, I could have just had, Blair. see, the thing was, I could, I would have done the Natty match if I didn't have to do it this week. I would have waited two weeks. So, then we have uh, Chad Gable versus Sheamus in the last man standing match. And Sheamus wins. It was a good, pro- it was a good match. And it didn't further the rivalry like I wanted it to. So, that's not good. Um, all right, yeah. let's see. Um, John, you got good booking. Let me know when you're ready. So you got good booking. You didn't get any new rivalries or anything. You just got good booking. Um, Chris, you got good booking. Hey. Good job. AJ, you got good booking. Hey, there we go. Uh, do you want to write anything down this time, or do you just want to not even bother this time? Me, uh, I'll take a screenshot one second, just you know, when, when Twitch catches up. Uh, Wheeler, uh, Vinci, and Undertaker and Roberts, uh, they have a level one rivalry. If you want to take a screenshot of that, yeah, so they have a rivalry. Okay, yeah. And then, uh, Bailey and Cindy Fluff have a level two rivalry now. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm glad I got good booking. I think last week I kind of just got like shit into the stick. Well, I say last week, more two months ago. 
Yeah, Lorenzo uh, got injured for two weeks. What did I? I got good booking. Uh, I'm gonna start writing some stuff down. So, yeah. So, Green and Chauncey are injured for three weeks. Um, the Blonde Strowman and Scripps will have a level four rivalry. I'll probably blow that off next week. And then Drew Gulak and Brutus Creed. Level one rivalry. And then Julio and Bianca Belair. Julia and Bianca Bellea, level one rivalry. Uh, Blair Davenport. Ivy Nile, level one. Got a lot of new rivalries this week. Then Finn ba uh, and then yeah, Chad Gable and Sheamus stayed at level three. <clears throat> Let's see what everyone said about your shows, though. So, John, you gained um, 32,000. Um, you had thirty-two thousand seventeen in fan cha uh, change. You had you gained forty-five thousand new fans. Um, the total fans were one million two hundred eighty-five thousand two hundred seventeen fans, and you gained um, sixty-four thousand nine hundred eighty-two dollars, which brought you a total of seventy um, seven thousand four hundred forty-two dollars and eight. Um, sorry, seven thousand four hundred forty-two dollars eight hundred thirty-one cents. I don't know. I had said that long, but you can see it on the screen. Um, let's take a look at what people are saying about uh, the show. Um, Ivo P P Potnik, SmackDown is too um, is too small a stage for me, so I'm moving to a um, on to a bigger and better fins. So on. Oh, I so that card that AJ played on you, you just lost the red monsoon, um, John. So you don't have. What a shame. Sorry. Uh, at Wall Street, Big loss right there. 86. He says, breaking news, Red Monsoon has um, decided to uh, seek another brand to work with. No big loss, I guess. At Top mm. Monster, I know Wyatt is a fighter. Uh, that's injuries not going to get in his way. And then at Carl Anderson, WWE says, if you could only fit as well, um, if you can only fight as well as you talk, JBL, all bulk and no bite. Um, at Mercedes Monet says, probably a surprise that Rhea Ripley lost to Ignition. At, at Educated Hotel 82. Why does she care? It might be in a rivalry, that's why. Um, at Ignition Hotel 82 says, Matt Jackson has been putting in so much work. Kind of worried, though. Been looking rough lately. At Ultimate Zyro TLC says, decent enough promo by Becky Lynch tonight. Uh, at Light and Ignite, which is Ignition, says, Great match for you if we look forward to stepping into the ring with you again. At Mr. Sharpshooter, it says, Jackson beats um, Williams, and so easy, too. Um, and then at Superstar Sensation ZZ says, Don't really get why SmackDown want to push JBL. Why you want to push JBL, John? That, that person wants to know why. <laughs> they don't get it. Why you want to push JBL? Heat. He's got heat. That's, that's a good. Was that? Do you think that was James uh, sending that tweet? Because um, you know, it's a... <laughs> might have been pushing for the Billy Kidman WWE champion. <laughs> Super sensation, big red, uh, red flame fan. Mm. 
All right, ready? AJ, here's what they're saying about your show. Um, All right. Yeah, you got uh, 56,000 new fans. Um, wow, that's a good amount. You, uh, your fan change was plus 43,204 fans. Uh, so your total fans was 1,266,754 fans. You uh, gained twenty thousand eight hundred thirty-six dollars in the bank, so you have a total budget now of eight hundred fifty-eight thousand six hundred seventy fans. Uh, let's see what the same show. Bad. Good show tonight. Hashtag NXT 2.0. That was by uh, at Director Strico eighty-one. Um, then at Three Count Warrior eighty-four it says Undertaker and Dante Roberts are an incredible tag team. So you might want to screenshot that AJ. That Undertaker and Dante Roberts are an incredible tag team. So right. At squared figure um, four of the world says, looked like Chad Sagan. Which is funny because they lost, too. Yeah, I mean, you know, sometimes you're not going to always win your first match, so. Yeah, losing style. Uh, looked like Chad Sachs Lorenzo picked up an, uh, a knock tonight, but it didn't look too, didn't seem too bad. Well, he's injured for two weeks, so I guess it's, I guess it can't be that bad if he's only injured for two weeks. Um, yeah. At Ultimate Phenom 75 says, really varied show. To add it to the quality, keep it up, NXT 2.0. Um, at Stone Cold Sinner 89 says, Giovanni Vigia and Joe Wheeler worked okay as a tag team, I guess. So I guess I didn't really think. I they guess they fucking won. Again, it's like the losing team is like, man, they're so good together. Their chemistry is amazing. The winning team is like, eh, you know, they're whatever. <laughs> uh, at Viking Cyborg 896 says, uh, Stax Lorenzo is such a natural at tables matches. Need to see, um, need to see this more often. Well, they're not going to see it. For well, two hey, break it. Yeah, you're not going to see him for another two weeks. Yeah, and then at 360 Beefcake 92 says, "Feels like uh, this could grow into a legendary rivalry between Bailey and Cindy Fluff." Um, yeah, yeah. John and Chris, you're never going to believe what Timbo's uh, Twitter handle, well, X handle is. It's at Real Man's Man. That's his Twitter handle. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hell, yeah. Um, He's a man. Was that a rib on William Regal when they made this? Or do you think they even knew what they were doing? I don't know. <laughs> like, <laughs> I know um, Brian played his with that song when he came out. It was a uh, joke for him on Superstars. But uh, here's what he said. You ever pity a bad superstar like Randy Orton and give them a free win? Even I can can be dangerous sometimes. That's what he said. So generous. That's that's hilarious, actually. Yeah. Uh, at, at, yeah, you know, I, I felt like losing, you know, the sun was in my eyes. <laughs> <laughs> um at Sergeant Roberts says, uh, I see Gunther was up to his usual dirty tricks against Chan and Stax Lorenzo. So, uh, I guess he pulled a dirty move use the pocket sand technique. And then at Swiss Chairman 98 says, Absolute wild. Gunther had an incredible match with Chan and Saxo Can, Can't deny Lorenzo made the match special. So I guess it had nothing to do with Gunther. It was all Chan and Saxo So it's nothing to do with Gunther yeah. at all. So uh, Nothing. So what I realized from these comments is the uh, losing team's lost in style. <laughs> I guess so. And the winning team was just like, oh, whatever. So, yeah. Isn't that, isn't that the most wrestling show of, of all time? <laughs> Maybe. I, I don't fucking know. Ask him the wrong guy. The buried. Yeah, it's like the bit. Whoever loses, no, we want them to win. No, no, no. It's a burial. <laughs> the shovel's ready. Yep. All right, Chris. Here's, here's what you did. You got 45,750 new fans. So that, good job, Chris. Um, Hell Yeah. Your fan change was 32,000. I came out to see Brooks Jensen. He disappointed all of them. Uh, he, your fan went up by 32,883. Your total fan change was 1,273,761. You gained $80,581 in the bank. Um, your total, so now your total budget is 641,560 fans. Uh, here's what they're saying about your show. At Red Cyborg 89 says, Angel Garza and Alberto Korea were an incredible tag team. They think they're an incredible tag team, Chris. So, they are. Yeah. I wonder why. I, I just don't know. So, um, At uh, Brufus uh, Critic Fiend says, uh, Hoping Rhodes makes a full recovery. Take your time. We'll be, we'll be walking. We'll be waiting for you to return. I must just say, We'll be walking for you to return. So I don't understand. <laughs> 
I guess they'll walk in. So, um, yeah, what do you have to say about that? Are you hoping Cody makes a full recovery? I hope he does. Um, then at Top of Artists, uh, AU says, Cam Gord versus Camilla Hayes was rough. Doesn't help that the fighting styles don't really complement each other. So they, I don't know what you want to say about that. Get over it. <laughs> at Trick Williams says, good effort by Humberto today. They say you earn more from your defeats than your victories. I mean, AJ so says that a lot. I mean, that they complimented all the losers on that show. So, um, Then we have at uh, Extreme Hitman Wu says, uh, Cruz and Williams take the Raw Tag Team Championships. That's all he said. Um, at Colossus Music of the World says, Raw, you need to give Alexa Bliss a break in, um, once in a while. Gotta force an early retirement if this keeps up. So I guess you have to start giving Alexa Bliss a break, Chris. So, um, And then at Viking Card, um, Carcino, 2093 says, Alexa Bliss on a great run right now, on a total rampage. So, I don't know who you have, you'd have to pick who you're going to listen to there, Chris. Either the person that says that Alexa Bliss is on a rampage, or the, the person that wants you to give a time off. You're in a tough dilemma. There. Oh, that... Huh? Uh, definitely not the top one. And then at Miss Figure 8 Mega says, this is funny, Chris, Tiffany Stratton and Alexa Bliss have absolutely no chemistry as a tag team. Um, what do you think about that? Then why are they the tag team champions then? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> um, and then at Mysterious Takeover says, um, tight match between Tiffany Stratton and Thea Hale. Uh, Hale could easily have won it. And then at High Flyer 80 says, Alexa get him pushed a lot. There was two later. other people in that match. I, I guess it, I guess that I guess I guess, the, I guess they were the only ones that mattered. So. But yeah, a lot of a, a, a lot of people think Alexa Bliss is being pushed a lot. So I guess you're I guess you're pushing Alexa Bliss a lot. So good job. I would hope. I would think so. She's my freaking women's tag team champion and the women's world champion, actually. All right, so let's see what's going on here. I gained fifty one thousand new fans, um, and I gained fifty three thousand eighty nine fans in total. My total fans are one million. Uh, 405,130 fans. Um, I gained 39,115, um, you know, money-wise. I, I gained that much money. Total budget, uh, $343,057. Um, and then let's see what they're saying about my show. So, they say, so uh, Sammy and Chelsea work really well as a tag team together on it, um, which... I can't do it for three weeks because uh, Chelsea Green's injured. Um, that was by at NXT Critic. Um, and then at Fighter Champion EU says, walking wounded out there tonight. Chelsea picked up an injury and pretty sure Chelsea did as well. And then at 450 Liberty 86 says, Finn Balor dropped a great formal tonight. And then at NXT Upper uh, Tube says, holy crap, Led Davenport finally won a match because I don't think she's won very much. So... That at holy fan um, musician says tonight's NXT was a bit of a come down after the good stuff they put on last week, because I think last week was PLE week and I kind of, you know, went went all out for that one. And then at Stone Cold uh, Rabby eighty nine says Natalya and Chelsea defend their tag titles successfully. Sammy and Chelsea are not happy about that outcome. That at fighter. Circle and A says, Hatchag NXT is a show to watch, and Drew Gulak is the reason <laughs> is the reason why another oh my gosh. Um, John, do I need to explain this to you or are you aware of what's going on with Drew Gulak right now? Uh I'm assuming it's not good. So Chris, why don't you kind of ex why do you explain why this comment doesn't really re um relate too well? He uh he was not a very uh, well-liked person. I'll put it that way. He was taking okay. advantage of people in the ring. He was told numerous times to stop, but he didn't stop. And Ronda Rousey accused, it, accused him of grabbing her jaw. Dro uh, pant strings. And then just let his contract expire. I see. Yeah. So that's that, why. Yeah. That, that, that's 
That's why yeah. it doesn't translate too well. Um, speaking of Drew Gulak, he posted on X, Buddha's Creed never stood a chance. I'm blending the dominant... Ooh, okay, this doesn't translate too well now either. I'm blending the dominance to NXT. The dominance. <laughs> um, yeah. And then at Hacksaw Libre Wu says, Sheamus gets payback on chat, Gable. What a great rivalry. That didn't further it off. Um, and then at Cruiser Music... How is it so great if it didn't further it? I don't know. And then Bianca Belair was caught out by Julia tonight. Look forward to seeing uh, them settle things in the ring. So let's see. John, you got the injury we have because you did your commissioner goal. Uh, AJ, you got the bad timing again, so you can use that on somebody. Oh, you got double cards, mm-hmm. AJ. Um, you, you can uh, double the cost of an opposing brand's matches for next week's show. Uh, and Chris, you got to the moon, which you knew that already. And I didn't get a power card. So let's see. Let me know when Twitch catches up and we can say who's winning. Tell me, right? Everyone's, everyone tell me when they're ready. I'm ready now. Okay. Yep. So number one, I have a, I have a 1,405,130 fans. Uh, by budgets, $343,057. Um, John, you're number two. Um, you can thank Steve for that because he helped you get there. Um, yeah. And Which is kind of ironic that Steve was the one that helped you get to number two, knowing your rivalry on WWE Aftershock. I kind of didn't really plan it for that. Can, can they coexist? <laughs> Um, and then Chris, your number three. Um, Let's go. You better uh, keep that going because AJ's creeping up, and you're gonna. Right now, you guys are all like pretty evenly level. It's just me. It's just like kind of so far ahead of you guys that like you're gonna have to like pull something big to catch me or something. You're I'm crushing okay. us on fans. Yeah, but like, I think the only way you guys can like beat me is if you guys do your trophies. So that's that's what I'm saying. Like doing your trophies really helps you. So. Um, yeah, it's a, it's crazy how many fans you got. Like, yeah, like you said, we're all pretty like evened out. Uh, and then you're just like, yeah, no, you know, fucking almost half a uh, million and a half, no big well, deal. Don't forget too. Um, every time, oh, Chelsea, actually Chelsea Green and Shotzi get an injured benefit in me because don't forget I have that shakeup where I'm gonna gain fans with every injured star on my show. And don't forget it, Triple H just gave me that thing where I'm going to gain more. Like, Triple H really helped me out. Like, my, my fans are going to go up so much because of everything that's going on right now. So it's like, um, yeah, you guys, you guys should be worried. Um, you guys have to, like, pull out Hail Marys to, like, really catch to really catch me. Um, but, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Um, overall, how did you guys think this week went? John being back after being back, how do you think? Your show went after being gone for a while and coming back and seeing how your show's going. That's going well. What about you, AJ? How do you think your show's doing after, uh, you know? Uh, I, this week went really good. I think, you know, assuming, you know, the fates aren't against me next time, I think I can maybe uh, jump back up to third place or maybe even second. Who knows? Depends. Yeah. Um, Chris, how do you think you're doing right now as it comes to everything? I'm doing pretty good, I would think. Um, I'm going to end this off. Let's do our plugs and promotion. Uh, John, you got the least amount of stuff to plug, so let's, let's hear it. I don't. Yeah, that's, that's just kind of how it is now. So uh, there you go. Um, Chris, is there anything you want to plug or promote? When there's something to plug or promote, there'll be, there'll be something, but there is nothing right now. Uh, AJ, is there anything you want to plug or promote? With the amount of overtime I'm doing, fuck no. Um, so it's all on me to plug this stuff. Uh, don't forget to leave yet because we have to film next the next episode. I want to say next week's, knowing how knowing how this has been. Um, yeah, see you guys in half a year. Yeah. Um, <laughs> uh, so yeah, my stuff. Uh, Chris and I are going to do Aftershock again. We're going to do uh, WWE Stay of the Address since we've been so limited on doing Aftershock recently. Hopefully we can record that Monday and that will be out fairly soon. Uh, we have some tier lists we're going to do. We're going to tier list every SummerSlam main event that's ever happened. And then uh, uh, we have some other tier lists. Uh, we still have to do the Cody Rhodes one we want to do. And then we still have, um, with Bad Blood coming, 
since it's around the anniversary of the first Hell in a Cell match, we're going to tier list every single Hell in a Cell match that's ever happened. And then, uh, yeah, mm. there's just the other tier list and everything like that. Uh, as for AJ and I, um, we're going to get back in the saddle when it comes to making videos now that my trip's over. We didn't get OBB done like we wanted to. Um, we at least got to the point. We, we at least got to the point where I watched season eight, so it's that you know we were kind of happy about that, but we didn't actually record the video. Um, yeah, but uh, we'll do that soon, probably, and we'll also get back onto uh, Yellow Jackets. And, um, you know, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. So that's pretty much it, guys. Thank you guys for watching. This has been recorded in the past. We will talk to you guys in the future.